Hey guys, today we're going to talk about how Tom Cruise made his insane $600 million fortune. Let's get right into it. Tom Cruise, an American actor and producer, has been a household name in Hollywood since the 1980s. He's beautiful, talented, and extremely wealthy. Tom Cruise's net worth is $600 million as of writing. This isn't exactly surprising. Given his long history of appearing in blockbuster films, TV shows, commercials, and other endorsements, his bank account could be much larger. However, let us limit our attention to official reports. But how did the multi-award winning actor get to this point? How did his finances grow so much over the course of his year? Before delving into Tom Cruise's million dollar fortune, there are a few things to consider. Tom made his film debut in 1981 with a small role in Endless Love. His performance in Risky Business put him on the map just two years later. The film grossed $64 million on a $6 million budget, cementing his status as Hollywood's new heartthrob. He went on to star in some of the most important films of the last three decades. Top Gun, the cult classic, grossed $360 million worldwide in 1986, making it the highest grossing film of the year. Cocktail and Rain Man, both released two years later in 1988, were huge box office successes. Tom received his first Academy Award nomination in 1989 for the film Born on the Fourth of July. The hits kept coming as the 1990s were kind to him. Days of Thunder, Far and Away, and A Few Good Men were released in 1982. While he received critical acclaim for his performances in The Color of Money, Rain Man, and Born on the Fourth of July, his roles in the Mission Impossible franchise and Top Gun film cemented his place on the Hollywood Walk of Fame, with the latter film franchise grossing more than $11.1 billion worldwide. In addition to acting, he now makes a lot of money by producing. In 1993, Tom and his agent at the time, Paula Wagner, established Cruise slash Wagner Productions. Paula is credited with bringing Tom to the massive talent agency CAA. The two collaborated on the first Mission Impossible film in 1996. The 60-year-old was paid $70 million for his work on the first Mission Impossible film. After that, he was paid $75 million for Mission Impossible 3. According to CNW, the company has produced $3 billion worldwide to date. According to reports, the Hollywood actor invests his money in properties and other assets all over the world. He used to live in a gorgeous Beverly Hills mansion with his ex-wife Katie Holmes and their daughter Suri. According to sources, Tom paid $30.5 million for the mega mansion before selling it for $38 million to American investor Leon Black. The mansion, which was built in 1937, has seven bedrooms and nine bathrooms, as well as a classic European facade. In addition, Tom owns an 11,000 square foot estate in West Sussex. The English mansion was for sale for more than $3.8 million. This house has a lot of open space, lush greenery, a pool, a spa, and a private tennis court. It has eight bedrooms and five bathrooms, as well as a separate guest pavilion. The estate also includes an all-in-one entertainment area that includes a cinema, a game room, and a dance studio. Oh, imagine what money can buy and multiply it by two. That's how much money Tom Cruise has. Tom owns a couple of modern properties in addition to estates. He once sold his Hollywood Hills mansion to Eva Longoria for $11.4 million. The villa is fitted and finished in European style with wide plank wood floors. There are three in-suite bedrooms as well as a guest house as the fourth room. According to reports, Tom used this house for his Scientology practice rather than living in it. The list would be incomplete unless a vacation home was mentioned somewhere. Other celebrities go on vacation, but Tom Cruise owns a stunning Colorado ranch worth more than $50 million. The ranch has four bedrooms and three additional bedrooms in the guest house. It sits on 10,000 square feet of land and includes a personal gym, recreation room, and library. The Colorado estate was built in 1994 and features rustic cedar timber, native stones, and beam ceilings. Outside, there is a tennis court, a basketball court, and an ice hockey rink. There's also a private trail system that allows visitors to access and view the 4,270 meter high mountains. Though this sounds like the ideal dream home, Tom sold it in 2021 for a whopping $39.5 million. Tom also had a New York City apartment in the American Felt building. The 2,200 square foot house was previously shared by Tom's ex-wives. According to some sources, he also stayed with a couple of ex-girlfriends, including Rebecca de Mornay and pop legend Cher. According to reports, the apartment has two bedrooms, two bathrooms, and a gym. Tom sold the property for $3 million shortly after his divorce. Tom now spends his time in his multi-million dollar Florida penthouse. Tom, according to some reports, lives in an opulent penthouse in Clearwater, Florida. This location is apparently known as a Scientology headquarters, so Tom may want to stay close to his practice. The property has a rooftop pool, a cinema, and its own concierge service. The house also has a flight simulator room, presumably so Tom can continue to practice his Top Gun skills. It also has a car lift, which is used to transport Tom's collection of luxury automobiles to a secure nine-car garage. 
Tom purchased the penthouse in 2017 and occupied the top two floors to enjoy unrivaled city views. According to reports, Tom Cruise lives in the penthouse with his son, Connor. That's all for today. We'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.